Good morning, good morning, everyone. I feel pretty crummy. <laughs> Welcome to year five of daily vlogging. Hi, Keanu. I took NyQuil last night. Turns out I took a 11 p.m. run to CVS because I could not sleep. My post-nasal drip was awful. So I got NyQuil and Mucinex, and I got, I took the NyQuil, and I don't think it did anything, because I felt like I did not fall asleep until 3 o'clock in the morning. Um, I think I was more like in and out, but I never hit REM sleep at all. Um, so yeah, my alarm went off at 8.30 this morning, because I have class this morning. <sighs> um, I'm, so like, today, now I'm exhausted but I think that's more because I did not get a good night's sleep in general rather than it being like a part of whatever I have um but um yeah I am like so tired it's still all in my throat I checked my temperature I still don't have any sort of fever I have no other symptoms now except for I guess being tired but as I said I think that has something to do with the fact that it would be the same as if I went to bed at 3 a.m and yes I would be tired um so yeah, I took Mucinex this morning um, to help with the post-nasal drip and like all of that. So this might be one of those very rare days that I take a nap in the middle of the day and that only happens when I'm sick. So I think, I don't know, we'll see how today goes and how I wake up tomorrow, but I think I am gonna go get a COVID rapid test tomorrow. Um, just to see, I mean, by the, it's not like I can do anything and it's not like there's any other treatment for it, you know, but just to know, um, but yeah. I will tell you what as well, this does not help my anxiety because <sighs> it just doesn't. This is what the rest of the day will be. My class went well this morning. I was tired but I did my pitch I think it went well um, so got lots of water I should have tea but I'm not a big tea fan I also don't think we have any my parents had this delivered to me because I'm sick so yes my parents got me chick-fil-a and had it ordered here so they were phenomenal I'm so thankful for them it is 2 p.m. I have more energy than I did this morning, but I'm absolutely going to be heading to bed definitely at like 9.30 tonight at the latest because I got not a whole ton of sleep. But um, I think that's the biggest thing, other than even my throat right now, is just the tiredness from not getting enough sleep at all. Plus the general just, you know, when you don't feel well, you're usually sort of tired as well. So anyway. I felt bad. I had to cancel my other things for today, but it is just so I can rest, which I hate having to do that so much. But I also don't have anything tomorrow. And um, the people from church told me to take Sunday to also rest. Um, turns out actually someone else from church was actually out last week because his family had a cold that was running around so really I do think I got I think it is the cold that's going around and I think I got it from Wombaland but thankfully we're on what like day four now none of my housemates have felt none of them feel bad Amelia still has like allergies but she has those every day so I'm very glad this has helped I haven't passed it on to any of them so I will say though I'm definitely well tired as I said but like my my I feel slow, like my brain is slow, so that too. Okay, so I am going out to CVS again because I'm getting Zyrtec. Because here's the thing, I do not have many allergies as that I know. I'm allergic to the medicine sulfa and that's basically it. I get hives when I have that, but I think I'm also like oak affects me a little bit when oak is blooming but I have now tried NyQuil and Mucinex and they have done nothing 
both of them have have not relieved my symptoms in any way or I shouldn't even say symptoms my symptom the one thing in any way so I'm beginning to think it's not a cold it might be an allergy because allergy medicines and cold medicines work differently and have different you know things in them so I'm getting Zyrtec because it's the more fast acting it's it's faster acting than Claritin I know Claritin works for me though so depending on their prices I might just get both but goodness gracious I am I'm not nearly as tired as I was this morning but this post nasal drip is killing me oh my gosh like oh there's a deer um so anyway yeah my nose is like a tiny bit runny but the fact that like cold medicine is not like it's not responding at all and that's what makes me go this is weird now if i try zyrtec and that doesn't do anything i might be calling someone and just being like look i don't know what to do like something is wrong and i don't know what it is and i can't fix it like even if it is like a cold or even when you have like the flu and stuff you can take those things to get rid of of those symptoms or to you know lessen those symptoms those aren't working for me so i'm really confused i'm really in there's a cat oh my god there's a cat um that's really annoying so yeah especially because it's basically stayed at the same type of symptoms for like four days now so i am over this i am so over it um yeah, I just want something that'll work, really. I, that's all they want. I got Zyrtec and Claritin, and I got confirmation that I can take the Claritin, I mean, take the Zyrtec, because Clair, um, Zyrtec usually works faster than Claritin, um, that I can take it as soon as I get home. So let's hope that works. And if it's allergies, that means I haven't been contagious, which is good. But I'm glad I took the, you know, the precaution. I have taken the Zyrtec. Let's hope it kicks in soon. So, the, um, what's the word? The allergy medicine has definitely helped more than the other medicine, so I'm thinking that's a positive sign. It hasn't taken everything away fully, but, um, I know sometimes the second round you take it, it's more in your system, which, of course, it's a 24-hour one, so I have to wait a while. Um, and depending on how I feel tomorrow, I might even switch to Claritin because I know that one works for me. I hadn't used Zyrtec before now. But, um, yes, I'm finishing this episode of Ant Farm and I'm going to bed. We are getting our AC, a whole new unit, tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. So I'm very glad it's going to be fixed before they go to camp. But, anyway, I'm heading to bed. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. All my social media is in the description. Love you all.